T Plus dry roller replacement. Turn off power and disconnect data and power cables. Open the side housing door by lifting up on the handle. Remove media by lifting the lever and pulling the media out of the feed pad. Remove media from housing. Locate and unscrew the thumb screw on the side of the printer and tilt back. Open the print head assembly by pinching the latches inward. Unscrew the thumb screw located below the cutter assembly and lift the cutter assembly. Carefully disconnect the cutter motor cable from the interface board. Release the two drive roller bearings and push them up and out of the left and right side frames to remove the drive roller. Carefully push the new drive roller into the left and right side frames. Plug the cutter motor cable back into the interface board. Reattach the cutter assembly to the printer making sure to hook it on the left and right side cutter hooks. Screw the cutter assembly thumb screw back into place. Close the print head assembly cover. Be sure you hear the left and right click. Lift the printer back to the original position and screw the thumb screw back into place. Plug in power and data cables before turning your printer back on. Place media in housing. Replace media in feed path and the auto load feature will take care of the rest. Close the side housing door.